Sit tight. What do you think? We're not getting in this way. They'll have time to murder the Doge before we're able to get through all these guards. Careful to avoid the mission, so I, just so I can synchronize. <laughs> Look at that. Archers everywhere. And the walls are impossible to climb on this side.
against the Serene Republic and will be executed publicly in the Piazza San Marco. Come on, man. Good citizens. He needs a wisdom. That's a lot of people down there. <laughs> He's gonna take the much safer route. <laughs> Bene, we're in luck. Looks like there's a perfect path up the scaffolding to the roof of the basilica. Shall we? There. Yeah, we were both just up there, but you know, it's okay. <laughs> Ezio, come on, man. You're killing me here. <coughs> Why does he not grab? Ezio, look! Isn't that him? Grimaldi! Don't you understand what I'm offering you, signore? Listen to me, please. Or this will be your last chance. How dare you! I'm sorry. Mi dispiace. I meant nothing by it. I'm only looking out for your safety. We're running out of time. There's no way through this fence, and there are guards everywhere. Diavolo! Andiamo. It's impossible. There's no way in or out for men. Only birds. Yes. Birds. Where are you going now? To see my friend Leonardo. Carlo Grimaldi. Emerging from his palace in Monaco with a craving for political power, Carlo quickly became a key guest at the tables of Venetian nobility. While his reputation for discretion earned him entrance into the back rooms. Here's how the old bastard ended up in the Council of Ten. While visiting the head of the council, Ignacio Contarini, Carlo ran into Ignacio's daughter. Desperate for help and aware of Carlo's trustworthy reputation, she confided in him. Her father had arranged her marriage, but she wanted to run away with the son of one of the servants. They'd been in love since they were children, and they planned to start a new life in Milan, where they could be free of her father. Carlo suggested immediate action, an escape by ship that night. 
the two lovers followed his instructions, and as they climbed the gangplank, they were free. That is, until Ignazio appeared on deck. Carlo was rewarded for his loyalty to the Contarini family. While true love, well, see for yourself. I don't think I could go in that tomb yet. Not until we own it. Okay, so... Love how that boat is restricted, too. Yeah, I guess just go all the way back to the mission. Alright, let's go. I got stuffs to upgrade. I've got money to collect. I'm gonna have so much money, man. I think I'm gonna be able to get f my full metal armor, which is gonna be so nice. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be amazing. I have like the most health. That's a lot of Florence. Buongiorno. Can I Salute, Serezio. Shall we take a look at the list? I think I got everything. Yeah, I literally have bought up everything. Buon viaggio.
love it. Pleasure, signore. Return what anytime. Do I look like? Dude. Oh my gosh, I look so amazing. Only the height of fashion. I don't even need that. Don't even need that. Another yet. time, then. Look at how much Bring health I have six. now. Holy oh, snap. I have done what I can. That's a lot Try of health squares. Thank you. Do come again. Holy snap. That's a lot of health squares. <laughs> I literally can't buy anything else. I don't think there are any more dies. At least not ones that I want. Oh. Then why a longer it seems? Come, don't be shy. I only aim. I have everything I ever want. Where am I going? Get back to Venice. I think that's where, close to where Leonardo is. Database user manual, manual for control information. Information. <laughs> okay. Ambassador, the council reminds all citizens not to eat the cat. Look at my outfit, man. This is tight. I love it. I love this game. Have I mentioned I love this game because I love this game. Okay, where do I go from here? Must be a drunken wager. Knock, knock. I need your help, Leonardo. 
Does it work? What? What are you asking? Does it work, Leonardo? Can it really fly? I don't know. It's only a prototype. An idea. It's not ready yet. Have you tried it? No. It's too dangerous. To test it, you'd have to leap off a tower. Who would be mad enough to do a thing like that? Leonardo, I think you just found your madman. Test Leonardo's flying machine. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. So, how does she work? Have you ever watched a bird in flight? It's not about being lighter than air. It's about grace and balance. You must use your body's own weight to control your elevation and direction. Good luck, Ezio. Oh boy, help me now. Dude, that looks so sick! Oops. <laughs> well, they inverted the controls, so that's great. <laughs> I can't believe it! It worked! It really worked! You flew, you? Ezio! You flew! See? But not very far. Well, what were you expecting? The machine wasn't designed for distance. All right, look. Let me go over my plans here. Maybe I can find some way to extend the duration of the flight. Ezio, my men tell me Carlo has the poison. We must hurry. Antonio, this is Leonardo, the master inventor who built this... this pezzo di merda. Hey, it's not the machine's <laughs> fault. It's mine. I've checked and rechecked my blueprints. It's just impossible. I don't know how to extend the flight. Da ah, che idea del cazzo! Eureka! Of course! <laughs> Genio! What is he doing now? It rises. It needs fire. Heated air under its wings will lift the machine. Leonardo, what good is one fire going to do? Not one fire, Ezio. A dozen, built all across the city. Enough to carry you from here all the way to the Palazzo Ducale. How? Ah, oh, capisco. My men could do that. But you are forgetting about the guards. Don't worry. I will take care of them. I'll give the order to have my men moving behind you. And hold the locations. They'll light them all up the second the sun goes down over San Marco. Take care of the guards so Antonio and his men can light the fires needed to provide lift for the flying machine. Oh, this is awesome! Oh, this is so cool! I'm excited. I don't- why am I looting? I don't even need to loot. Oh, really? Wow. That's so stupid! Man! That is Deal. like Not so too bright, stupid. Are you? Now I can't see anything. It's so dark. Yeah. <laughs> 
Come on! Stand and fuck <laughs> Wow, that's far, that's across the river. Oh wait, I should probably actually target that because I can't. I don't know which one of these cross flames it is. Okay. Hey, okay. do you have your knives? Oh, that just made my day. <laughs> <laughs> 